Welcome back, and if you're new here, my name's Bianca. Today I'm gonna take you on some of my top items and tips for breastfeeding. My first child's 14 months old, and I was going through his newborn stuff, and these are the items that I highly recommend. All of the links will be in the description box, and let me know if you have any questions along the way. First big item, of course, is a breastfeeding pillow. This is Frida brand, and I really enjoyed it. It has this little belt with this back support. So what I would do is I would have my child on the bed. I would click this in, go get my child, and then waddle over, sit on the chair, and adjust as needed. Another great thing is that there's like a little divot for your baby to lay here. And then once they get bigger, there are two inserts here. You'll be able to take the inserts out as they get bigger because you want them at the best angle for breastfeeding. We went to Virginia for my sister's graduation and he was around three months old. This was great just to lay on my lap, have him here during the whole plane ride. Next, a really big thing, which I wish I tried these a lot more before I had the baby, are nursing bras. This is my favorite nursing bra. I would wear this around and feel very supported, not like I was gonna fall out or anything. These are latched, and so they really make sure that they stay put. I had ones where they were crossed and you kind of pulled open. You would just bend over and everything would fall out. There's a lot of room to go back and forth, very comfortable highly recommend these. The Even biggest thing, and I'm telling you, if someone told me this before I had my kid, I'd be like, Psh, no, you're lying. That's not true, whatever. No, you need to stock snacks because breastfeeding takes a lot out of you. Here is our mini fridge in our bedroom. I had protein shakes, applesauces, snacks, and then I had a side table over here with a galore of snacks. You are going to be hungry. I would eat in the middle of the night constantly. I will link a similar fridge and then I will link the protein bars that I had to have at night. They are a lot of calories, but you need a lot of calories in order to produce breast milk. Again, before you have the baby, I highly recommend getting a rocking chair and not just getting it and placing it, but actually sitting in it, maybe watch a show or two in it to make sure that you can lean back, you have proper head support, your arms are comfortable, you're able to rock. Even if you have your breastfeeding pillow on you, just do that and get comfortable with being in that chair because you will be in that chair a very long time. This chair I got off of Facebook Marketplace for $50. It does not have to be expensive. This is the most comfortable chair that I have in my house. I'll see if I could find something similar to this and link it. Before the baby's here, I would highly recommend finding a hobby, something to listen to, something to read, something to watch on your phone. I had a lot of trouble just sitting here, okay? I would watch all my reality shows and I would run through them so quickly that I didn't have anything else to do in this chair and I would be bored. And then I would get upset of why am I sitting in this chair for so long? I don't wanna be breastfeeding, I wanna be doing other things because I didn't have anything else to do. Find a game, find a book, find a series, find your thing that you could do sitting in a chair and try to get into the habit of taking some time to do that in the chair with the breastfeeding pillow with the nursing bra i'm telling you it's a lot but if you just do that maybe once a week leading up maybe for like two three weeks you're going to be more comfortable with the scenario when it comes if you enjoyed this video please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing also if you have any other topics questions around first time mom items that you need please leave them in the comments below and I'll make a video on it. Again, this worked for me, may not work for everyone, uh, but I hope you enjoyed this video. See you next time.